What is going on there, folks? Welcome back here. What a way to start. Well, we haven't quite started off the new year yet, but what a way to end the new year with a super major flare coming in right now uh, from a far side sunspot. There is the uh, eastern limb sunspot region we we're chatting about this morning. This is uh, currently at an X 4.5. Looks like this peaked out at around an X 5.0. Goodness, uh, that would make it uh, one of the stronger, uh, more stronger flares that we've seen in a long time. In fact, uh, here's the top 30 solar flares of Solar Cycle 25. So no doubt this would definitely beat all of those by a long shot. Long shot. Uh, this is just coming in right now, Sunday. Again, last day of the year. And uh, we're looking at a major, major blackout here in the radio uh, frequency range here across the sunlit side of the Earth, um, mainly affecting the low frequency and high frequency navigation systems out there. Uh, this, oh goodness, uh, again, this is on the far side of the uh, sun, but it is so definitely visible here. We've seen the sunspot region this morning. Um, this is not directed at Earth. I don't know if there's any impulsive event from this as far as eruptive activity or a CME. Uh, but this thing is definitely giant. Uh, and something that, uh, like I say, we haven't seen in quite a while. Look at this, X5. Goodness, that is a majorly strong event. I haven't noticed anything going on here with uh, any electronics. Um, but I've definitely been feeling energetic today. I don't know why. Maybe it could have something to do with putting 2023 behind me, but, uh, yeah. So we'll watch for, uh, maybe watch for some earthquake activity uptick. A lot of times we do see, uh, these earthquakes ramp up following, uh, large CME impacts and also large solar flares. And this is no doubt, uh, one of the largest solar flares in quite a while, obviously, since, uh, well, I think this beats our last one uh, that we just seen here back in, uh, I think it was 2000, was it 2007 that we had seen a kind of an X flare similar to one of these that we've seen earlier this year. I think it was an X 2.8. So this one just blew it off the chart. We'll cover this a little bit more later today uh, when we get a little bit more information. But uh, goodness, it's toning down slightly, uh, as you can see here on the chart. But uh, that was a little shocker. Let's look at the magnetogram here. Uh, the region of interest over here obviously looks pretty complex. We chatted about this last night. We chatted about this this morning. Uh, keeping an eye on that for some further larger uh, potential. We'll catch you guys back here later on this evening. Look at that awesomely bright feature. All right, folks. Have a good one.